Oh my god, guys, 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 girls, guys. Toby Fox decided to release some, some strange new thing today called Deltarune, and is I, I'm pretty sure it's Undertale 2. I've seen a little bit. I, I'm, I'm, I'm going crazy right now. I literally just got out of bed and noticed all this going on. It was trending on Twitter. I'm, I'm going crazy. I'm literally still wearing my dressing gown because I just got out of bed to play this damn game. Let's get straight into this. Are you there? Yes. Yes, I am. I'm indeed here. Are we connected? To the internet, yes, I, I think. Oh god. Oh damn. Excellent. Truly excellent. Now, then and forever, we may begin. I don't like the fact that the, that the font was not centered. <laughs> Nitpicky. First, you must create a vessel. Select the head that you prefer. Alright. Why are they all so, like, creepy looking? It looks like messy frisk. I kind of dig it. But at the same time, I kind of dig that one. I'll go with this one. Um, yes. 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 Okay, B button is the new A button. I forget that. Select the torso. There's customization? What the heck? Um, we're gonna go like classic jumper. I, I don't really see the difference in either of those. Oh, one guy has like sleeves or something. Alright, we'll, we'll do that one. That's pretty good. Select the legs that you prefer. They all look the frickin' same. Apart from for some reason one leg is bigger than the other. <laughs> this is your body. Do you accept it? Yes. Pressing B as confirmation is really weird. You have created a wonderful form. Thank you. Now, let us shape its mind as your own. What is its favorite it's food? Sweet, soft, sour, salty, pain. Oh my god, I'm cold. Uh, we'll go sweet. Your favorite blood type. What? Um, the D. We love the D. What color does it like most? Uh, blue. We'll go my color. Why not? Please give it a gift. Kindness, mind, ambition, bravery, voice. I'd kind of like to say voice, but I'm gonna go kindness. How do you feel about your creation? They will not hear you. Um, hope. Hopeful that it's okay. Have you answered honestly? Yes. You acknowledge the possibility of pain and seizure. What? <laughs> Understood. Name your vessel. Um I'm just gonna put Frisk for the for, for the love of it, because why not? Uh, why why not? We called it Frisk. Frisk 2.0. And what about the creator? What? Your own name. That's... Concerning. But we'll go with Kingfish. Boop. Kingfish. Mm-hmm. Excellent. Truly excellent. Kingfish. Thank you. For your time. You're welcome, strange cre creator. Your answers, your wonderful creation, will now be discarded. <laughs> no one can choose who they are in this world. Your name is Jeff Goldblum. Oh, <gasps> oh my God, Chris. Chris, if you do not wake up, you will be late for school. This isn't the bedroom that was in the end of the first game. I'm, I'm, I'm curious. Is this an alternate universe, or is this like a prequel? I'll wait outside for you, alright?
All right, we are Kara. Good to know. We are teenage Kara. Good to know. All right. Clothes drawer. The drawer is mostly empty except for a school cross-country shirt with a tear in it. There are CDs under the bed. Classical, jazz, religious, ska. There's also a game console. It has one normal controller and one knockoff one. Yep, that's our mother, all right. It's a computer desk. There are many boxes under it filled with old books. It's a red wagon with a rusty birdcage in it. Looks like it's seen quite a few crashes. What's that stain? It's stained. It just it worries me that it was like a birdcage that's like open and like a blood stain in the corner. I'm like, what? Alright. We're in a house. Oh, mirror. It's only you. Hey, I dig it. Little reference to the first one. The door is locked. I mean, I don't know if this is Undertale 2, but considering... It seems that there's characters from the original in it, then th to me that, that makes me think that it is. There are crayons in the drawer. The labels have, fi have long faded and there's no green. Alright. There are many books. See, I'm yawning because I literally just woke up. Tales of Snails, a storybook. Snails do not have tails, a scientific refutation. Can snails help your garden? Um, not really. An assigned copy of The History of Humans and Monsters by Gerson Boom. I feel like I recognize that name. Was that the old guy? Or the tortoise dude? Ooh. The layout of some of these like houses is very earthbound. I really dig it. There's a photo on the fridge. It's of you, your mother, and your brother. Sorry, what? Brother? What? Frisk? Maybe? There's some white fur stuck in the drain. Lovely. There's some cinnamony batter kicked on the stove top. I also thought I'd add as well for anyone that might have watched some of my last videos. I'm using my girlfriend's video camera. She was kind enough to let me use it for videos. So the quality won't be quite as good. Because her camera wasn't quite as good as mine. Although mine wasn't really that, that, that great either to be honest. But anyway. It's a trash can. Somehow it's emitting a pleasant floral scent. Cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters and gingerbread humans. Aww. It's a landline phone, but you already have a cell phone. Sweet. Can we... Ooh. We have two dollars. Items. Items. Um, can't access. H how did I... How did I do that? Why? Oh, stats. Okay, a weapon, pencil, armor, bandage, money, too. So, call home. I get the feeling that, uh... And that you can't see this, because it's, it's actually part of the window. But the window says the beginning. So I get the feeling that if this isn't Undertale 2, it could be like a demo or like a teaser. I'm also kind of nervous because it is Halloween today, the, the day that this got released, so... I'm a little nervous this is going to be spoopy. It's a TV. Doesn't seem to even be plugged in anymore. Alright. Interesting. Chris, there you are. You might still be able to make it. Chris, it is a beautiful day today, is it not? I hope it stays this way when Asriel visits next week. What? But I wonder, after the excitement of university, will he still enjoy coming home to this little town? Is this an alternate universe? Hey! Is that Kai's um, or Bratty's mom? Oh my god. One time's a cop now. Light, light, <laughs> Oh my god, I'm getting teary eyed. And the school as well, oh my god. It's not quite the same as the end of Undertale 1 though, because the school originally had the, uh... <gasps> holding my hand. Had the, uh, the bushes, and Asgore made the pap- uh, yeah, papyrus hedge. Aww. Your arms are huge, mum. You're a beast. Alright. To school we go. <gasps> Out of face! She's a teacher now? There's a snake. Is that Tem? Oh, uh, C Chris, we, we found you weren't coming today. Um, we're, we're doing group projects this month. Um, so, uh, walk around and find a partner, I guess, okay? Hi, Tem. Chris, how are they sized? Tem already has partner. Trying to have to freaking egg. Of course, egg is partner. Screw you, Tem. <gasps> That's the kid! Oh my god! Yo, Chris, um, show up earlier next time, okay? 
I ended up having his partner with Snowy. <laughs> now he keeps turning to me and saying, Howdy, partner, like a cowboy. Partner? I hardly know her. <laughs> what do you think of that one? Funny, right? No? Well, I got news for you, pal. I already got a partner. Scram. Alright, sorry, dude. Can I be partnered with Snack? Solid Snack. Ah, uh, Chris late again, I see. Hmm, you yeah, partner? Sorry, I'm already partners with the second smartest student. Though, uh, wait, Chris, now that I think about it. Your unique skill set might help a lot in this assignment. Pfft, nah, what the hell's that face? <laughs> I actually want to get an A. <laughs> Screw you, buddy. Hey, Chris, what's up? Did you lose your pencil again? Here. You want the candy cane one or the one with the lights on it? <gasps> Can I have one? <gasps> you want me partners? Um, sorry. Birdly already asked me. Damn it, I thought you were gonna be monster waifu. But I could ask Miss Alice if we can make it a group of three. I'll ask if you're sure. Uh, not yet. No offense. Yeah, I'm sure it's someone else you could ask. Yeah, what up? Click, click, tap, tap. Taken. Alright. Hey, Chris, you know, Jackington and Caddy are like always partners. <laughs> We're the ultimate academic duo ever since our first gym class. It was hula hoop day, and they ran out of hoops for us. So she used me instead. That's our origin story, bro. Alright, I guess we'll be in partners with you, um, but Beardly, whoever that is. Yes. Okay, I'll ask. Miss Alphys, um, is it okay if we have a group of three? Hey, what? No, I do not approve of this. Abort. What? But Chris doesn't have a... Noelle, what, what were you saying? Um, sorry, I didn't hear you. She was just saying we're fine being alone. Actually, I just wanted to know if... Noelle, can you please speak up? I can't hear you. Oh, God. Um, uh, uh, hi, hi, Susie. Okay. <laughs> Am I late? Uh, no, no, you're fine. We're just, um, choosing partners for the next group project and stuff, and, um, <laughs> and Susie, you're with Chris. Great. Oh, joy. <laughs> Alphys' face says it all. Now, now that everyone's here, I'll, um, write the assignment. <laughs> Alright. You, you might want to sit down. Susie. Um. Uh, has, has anyone seen the chalk? <laughs> this is the third time it's gone missing, and, um, you all know I can't start class without some. Uh, can I? I'll, I'll help you. How about this? If no one speaks up, everybody gets in trouble. <laughs> Alright. Anyone? Please? Aw, oh, poor office. Um, th there might be a box in the supply closet. Miss Alphys, why don't Susie and I... G good idea, Noelle. Susie, since, since you came in last, um, why, why don't you go, go get it for me? Whatever. Alright. And, uh, Chris, can you go with her and make sure that she, um, actually gets it and, um, stays out of trouble, please? Thanks, Chris. See you later. <laughs> that face. God damn it. <sighs> Fine, teach. God, what time is it? We check the time. It seems to be time for class. <laughs> uh. Why are you eating chalk? That's a little strange. Uh, Chris. Didn't see you there. Yeah, what up, G? Hey. You didn't see anything just now, did you? No. Hmm. Can't even say. Chris. Uh oh. This is bad. Well, that's we're gonna make out. Hey. Let me tell you a secret. Oh God. Quiet people piss me off. You think just because you don't get, you don't say anything, I can't tell exactly what you're thinking. It's over. I caught Cezy eating all the chalk. 
This is your last chance, now she'll finally be expelled. <laughs> Come on, Chris. Don't act shocked. You know it's true. Everyone's waiting for it. Everyone wants it. So congrats, Chris. You got me. I'm done for. Just let me say one little thing. Seems like a waste to get expelled just for having a snack. So Chris, if I know you're gonna pull the trigger... <laughs> Why don't I just get expelled for some real carnage? Chris, how do you feel? About losing your face. Oh my god, that's terrifying. Chris, you've got a good mother. Be ashamed to make her bury her child. <laughs> Again. Alright, let's get this over with. We'll get more chalk, mostly back to class, and then Chris, you'll do our project. How's that sound? Don't bother answering. <laughs> okay. If you haven't gotten it by now, your choices don't matter. Wow, savage. Let's go, freak. I resent that. Just, just so clear. I resent that. Are you ready for the Sadie Hawkman's dance? This dance, all the chaperones were giant hawk heads. Sweet. And screech any students to make contact while dancing. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna explore. God damn it. Chris, what? Realize the babe classroom is a better fit for you? Hey, actually, I should come with you. Maybe I'll find a better partner in there. Nah, actually, let's not. D wrong way, Chris. D d wrong way, Chris. Alright, well, maybe if I just go- God damn it. Wrong way, Chris. Fine. You drank from the water fountain. <laughs> People put their mouth on that, you know. Yeah, I'm aware. School sucks. God, can you walk any slower or what? Nah, I get it. I'm not used to walking around without someone holding your hand. Come on, freak. Alright. That's scary. Well, here's the closet. Too bad. We we're just starting to have fun. The hell? Uh, hey, Chris. Is it me or... Is it really dark in there? Yep. What's the hold up, Chris? You gonna go in or what? Fine, if you're gonna be a wimp, then I'll... We're both going at the same time. Alright. Whoa. See, why are you so scared? There's nothing in here but old papers. Let's try and find a light switch. Alright. Um... That's weird. Can't find a switch. Guess it's further in. Are we going to another dimension? Um... Uh... Kinda big for a closet, huh? I think we'd have reached the end by now. Yep. Hey, Chris. I think this closet's, uh, broken. There aren't any walls. Well, we've worked hard enough. If Alphys wants chalk so bad, she can get it herself. Let's split. Uh-oh. What the? Hey! This is a funny let us out! Let us... Um... Uh, the floor, it's... Uh, we. Ha, <laughs> that's a cool little graphic. I like that. That was cool. The, why did we change color? Why are we now like a character from Steven Universe or something? I look cool. I dig it. The save point. At times, you see flick. You see flickering. The light only you can see. What's with the corners of the uh, box? That looks really cool. By second nature, you reach out and touch faith. Do 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 do. All right. I know I've been saying recently I'm going to be doing like 20 to 30 minute episodes, like 20 minutes, but I'm going to be trying to do a bit of an extended episode for this one. Alright. Weird. I do not know where I am anymore. 
That looks like a scary face. Can I inspect that? It's too dark to see anything. Alright. I can actually run, which is interesting. Creepy eye. If this was Zelda, I could shoot that with an arrow. And it would do something. I could shoot that one too. Ah! There we go. There's some bubbles. Hi, bubbles. I wish I could play with you. I think. Oh, God. This is why I'm starting to... Wait, what? Whoa, hold on a minute. I can't show this, obviously, but... The window text saying the beginning is gone. There's nothing there. It doesn't say anything anymore. That is cool, but a little bit creepy. Something glowing inside. Take it. Yes. You got the glow shard. There, how does the glow shard do? Ooh. Item. Equip. Power. Config. Um... Shimmering shard, its use is unknown. Okay. Interesting. Seriously though, why did we change colour? That's really creepy. That one's red. Ugh! I can get attacked in the overworld now? That's kind of cool, actually. That's a pretty interesting mechanic, I dig it. You bathed your body in the light. Power shines within you, breaking through the darkness. The pain you had melted away. The pain you had melted away. Eye puzzle. Alright. This land, only eyes blinded by darkness can see the way. Only eyes blinded by darkness. Alright, I was wondering if there was a... I don't know. That one's been blinded, because technically, I'm guessing the middle dot is like the position... Well, the dot's the position of the eye, and the middle dot's right in the retina. Oh. Never mind. That was easy. Okay, never mind. Alright, more creepy eyes, more strange creatures laughing at me. Yo, what up, Bubbles? Oh! I'm so sorry. I did not mean to hurt you. Oh, God. Alright. Apparently we're destroying all the Bubbles. I feel kind of mean for doing so, but whatever. Oh! <laughs> Hey, back off! Come any closer or not? Wow, you look really cool. C Chris? Phew. Hey, don't scare me like that, dumbass. Unless you want to get clocked in the face. Huh. Anyway, enough screwing around. We gotta find a way out of here. Alright. Um, where is here anyway? Doesn't matter, you, you got us in this mess, you get us out. Alright. Lead the way, Chris. Susie has joined your party. Oh my god, never mind, you walk way too slow. <laughs> I love how he's just staring at the screen like, really? Really? <laughs> like, this? Th this girl? Seriously? Wee! I wonder what that's made out of. What's that all about? Hey Chris, there's someone up here waving at us. Any idea what they want? You look like an onion. Oh, God. Run, Chris. Oh, Jesus. Undyne, are you, are you here? This is some Undyne stuff right here. Up. Uh, Up. Uh. Did it. Without a scratch, baby. Oh, yeah. Chris, down here. Go, 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 go! Whee! Oh, God. Woo! Without a scratch, baby! <laughs> Alright. We're in the dark now. The darker dark. Ooh. Even darker dark. Oh, you're not dead. Sweet. Got any idea what the heck this place is? Me neither. What if there's anyone in that building up there? Maybe. I'm guessing you're blocking my path because I have to go investigate. That's the bloke. You hear, buddy? Looks like a shop, but the door is locked. No one's inside. It's locked. It's locked. It's locked. 
front of you a castle looms beneath the empty town. A black geyser emerges from it, piercing endlessly into the sky. The power of this place shines within you. Alright, cool. Castle town. Hey, it's Zelda. A castle? Why the hell is there a castle instead of a supply closet? Welcome, heroes. Who's there? Do not be alarmed. I am not your enemy. Please, come forward, both of you. Interesting. You look like the... The person from the bot. That's... That's fascinating. Welcome. I am the prince of this kingdom. The kingdom of darkness. Chris. Susie. There is a legend in this land. A legend that one day two heroes of light will arrive. And fulfill the ancient prophecy foretold by time and space. Please, heroes. Listen to my tale. Okay. Very well, then. What happens if you press no? We don't get to listen to your tale. Uh, oh. Once upon a time, a legend was whispered among shadows. It was a legend of hope. It was a legend of dreams. It was a legend of light and a legend of dark. This is the legend of Delta Moon. For millennia, light and dark have lived in balance. Bringing peace to the world. But if this harmony were to shatter, a terrible calamity would occur. The sky will run black with terror. And the land will crack with fear. Then, her heart pounding. The earth will draw her final breath. Damn. Only then, shining with hope. Free heroes appear at world's edge. A human. A monster. And a prince from the dark. Only they can seal the fountains. And banish the angels' heaven! Only then will balance be restored, and the world saved from destruction. Today the Fountain of Darkness, the geyser that gives this land form, stands tall at the center of the kingdom. But recently, another fountain has appeared on the horizon. And with it, the balance of light and dark begins to shift. Okay. Chris, Susie, thank you for listening to my long tale. I deeply believe you two are the heroes of legend. That despite whatever enemies you may face, you two have the courage to save the world. Delta Warriors, please! Won't you accept your destiny? God damn it, Susie. Um, nah. <laughs> God damn it, Susie. Uh, what? Me? Some kind of hero or something? You got the wrong person. But, Susie, without you, the, 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 the world, it will. So what? The world gets destroyed. It's none of my damn business. Might even be kind of fun, honestly. Anyway, Chris, if you want to play pretend with this weirdo, stick around. I'm going to find a way out of here. S S Susie, wait! Um... Ho ho ho! <laughs> the heroes are already running away! And they didn't even know I was here! My dad's going to make me son of the month! <laughs> Who the hell are you? I'm the reason Ocean's voice is going to die. The bad guy. You clowns want to seal our dark fountain, huh? And still picturing you guys as clowns? Save the world from eternal darkness, huh? Good game. 
Um. Don't try to deny it. We both know you go east. It's your only way home. But I, Lancer, won't let you go there. And I've got a flawless two-step plan to ensure it. Step one, I thrash you. Step two, you lose. Um, nice plan, kid. R r r really Yeah, actually. Might have used it on you instead. Oh, okay. Um, we have act, item, spur, defend, and fight. Uh, we will act. Compliment. You tell Lancey you can't tell the difference between his clothes and his body. He seems flattered. His attack power went down. God damn it, Susie. Oh, you make me... Uh, wrong voice. I didn't get to read that. Oh, God. Wow, that is cool. That is really cool. I dig that. Act, uh, Lancer, warning. You tell Lancer to watch out for Susie's attack. He readies himself. Okay. Nice. And let's get fresh. Just kidding, that's you. Ah! Whew. Oh, God. This literally is Undertale 2, like, holy crap. Lancer switches gears randomly to appear competent. Um, warn again. Lancer laughs the idea that he would need your help. Alright, I'm just trying to be nice. So what are you guys doing after this, huh? Lancer is thinking about chips. Sam. Sam. Compliment again. He tries to compliment Lancer again. But he sees it as insincere. His attack power goes back up. God damn it. You should have realized I can mask my self-esteem levels. Whoa. Dodge, 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 dodge. Not too bad. Wait, wait a second. My bike's running out of fuel. Alright, you punk -aroos. You had the luck of the draw this time, but... Next time, you lose the losers will be you. <laughs> Bye, losers. I gotta get home for dinner. Alright, we didn't kill him. That's good. You won. You got zero XP and $35. I'm kind of worried that the game's gonna trick us into thinking that we uh, need to act on the enemies and instead it's better to fight them. Like an opposite version of the last or of Undertale, but I don't know. Are you two okay? Um, allow me to introduce myself more properly. I am. Jeez, can you take off that hood? I can barely hear you under there. Um, alright. Okay. Um, hello everyone. I'm Ralsei. Um, Chris, Susie, it's ever so wonderful to meet you. I'm certain we're gonna be like great friends and um... Best way to leave is east, right? Yes, that that's that's where we'll um... Got it. See you at school, Chris. Bye bye. That was a little bit deeper, but whatever. Um... I suppose it's just the two of us then. Yep. That's fine. Chris, I'm a prince, but, um, I currently don't have any subjects. I've been waiting alone here, um, my whole life for you two to arrive. So, I'm really happy to meet you. I just hope we can be good friends, Chris. That's fine. That's cool. Let's try and find Susie. She must be to the southeast. You lead the way, Chris. I am however going to leave this episode here for now. I will be playing much, much more of this. I'm going to be literally probably recording all of this in one session, so I'll be posting out all the parts as fast as I can. Let me know what you think about this so far. I think this is super awesome. I'm super hyped to be playing this right now, and I really can't wait to see what else happens in this game. But anyways, thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. P -p -p